a first round match is because I've just looked. I've just looked on my notes, and you know who's coming up next. No, 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 no more, no more. I need my, my voice needs to recover. Let's throw it back to the ring because you know who's coming up next. This one's going to be hype. I'm, I believe in these intros. I don't know about that. I mean, you might believe in those intros. I, I, I don't know. Man. Yeah, I'm with you, bro. That last one, I'm losing my voice. <laughs> Woo! Yo, give it up for Dude Kevin, y'all. All right, Beautiful. coming up now, after, listen, the story right, of Fujimura's path to top eight is right, crazy. Talk to to me. He lost his second Fujimura! game in a champion versus champion match. Yep. The reigning CEO Street Fighter V champion versus the reigning CEO Tekken 7 champion. Yes, we watched it. It was quite a beatdown, wasn't it, Logan? Wait, what's this intro? I have no idea what this song is. Stream, talk to me. Let me open the stream. What is this, guys? Is this, this is an American song? Doesn't sound Japanese. Some homage here to, to the US crowd, maybe? Sounds like Queen. Is this Queen? Yeah, it might be. Oh, it's Beatles. Really? Wait, hold on, I know this song. Fujimura, are you, are, you, are you serious, dude? <laughs> I respect it. <laughs> Takeda, please save the day. I have no idea what that was. Takeda, all please. Right, right. Please, um, please Fujimura save us. Fujimura makes his run for losers against King the Red. Mr. Crimson, Nauman, Enzo, Samurai, Takamura, Takeuchi, and Psycho. But let's see what the murder face has got for us. I believe. I believe in Takedo. Come on, man. He's got to have something. Come on, son. There comes Takedo. He's got a bottle of water. That's that's about it. <laughs> okay, well, give, give him a bit of hey, hey, hey. All right, here we go, here we go. Oh, there we go, here we go. <laughs> that doesn't get old. He's a maniac, <laughs> maniac on the dance floor. Uh, Takedo currently second in the CPT rankings. 1,345 points. First at NCR, first at Saigon Cup, second at FV Cup in Malaysia and Fighter Spirit in Korea. Fujimura, though, third place right now. He either wins the tournament or doesn't do very well at all. I love this. You brought this up earlier. Talk to the people about that. What does that mean, Logan? Please. So literally two weeks ago, these guys faced at, um, I believe it was, I want to say Taipei Majors. No, Fight Spirit. Fight Spirit. Okay. Uh, in Korea. Two weeks ago, these guys faced off. Uh, they also faced off in the uh, FE Cup Grand Finals. Both times, Fujimura came out on top. But it's been very back and forth uh, this year. Uh, Fujimura has won. Both Grand Finals actually went to resets. Uh, Fujimura won both times in the end. But it's been very back and forth. Fujimura has the upper hand at the moment. Logan, uh, where, in where, the you get, where are you getting all this beautiful data from, mate? I mean, it's... Well, it's some of it I am obviously out taken out, mind, out of uh, the just CPT computer, website, but... which you can find CapcomProTour.com. But also, a uh, shout out to Glenn at the Game 2K uh, for sending me some of this head-to-head -head information. He's got all of the top eights, uh, all of the head-to-head -head stats, tons of stats that you can find if you're into that kind of thing. Uh, check out the Game 2K uh, website. But right about now, Fujimura Takedo, a matchup that you would expect to see in Grand Finals at any event in the world. This is your loser's first round man what a juicy one i can't believe these guys are in losers sometimes that's just the way it goes down the level of quality we have here at ceo 2019 tokido versus fujimura we've seen this story before but it doesn't have a consistent outcome it's been very back and forth between these two over the last few years. If you remember last year, Takedo in top eight losers bracket had a 90% win rate. 90% win rate when he was in losers uh, in top eight. And I think it was something like 83% overall. He was crazy consistent. Not as consistent this year. Fujimura stepping up though. I think he's won two events in uh, June. He might, so yeah, he's I having think, a good month. He's won three all year as well. I mean, a lot of people said he's fallen off, but I think they're just going by his standard. Maybe he's mm. fallen off, but by anyone else's standard, this guy's very much well, in the top four. He's definitely adjusted globally. to that V trigger change uh, before he could just activate that Fumashiro Kanon oh, block to and get a free mix up. He now he's just it. optimizing. Oh, he definitely activates it on block, bro. He doesn't need to activate it on block, though, is the main thing. Yeah, but now he doesn't. He's really optimizing and making the most of it. I see him doing some crazy Round punishes one. with that. So here we go. This one is guaranteed to be Gourmet Gaming. Oh, nice. Thought he had a whiff punish there. No, he didn't. 
Aikido utilizing that standing light punch. Great horizontal range. It's a good button for checking. Yeah, beautiful V skill from the best folks in the game. Doesn't matter though. Runs straight into that medium kick. Tokido gets the meaty throw. And the dash to another one. Oh, confirms off that back dash. Just gonna switch corners here. I like that. Kunai in front. Oh, he didn't respect it. Oh, he got counted here. What one more he bet. Oh, he didn't do it. What a block from Takedo. Oh, it doesn't oh, matter. He does it that doesn't time. matter. <laughs> you reach, I teach. Shout to your hips. <laughs> you absolute scumbag. Beautiful mix up. Hey, bro, there. yesterday I saw, um, I saw Shad do two empty jumps and the exact situation yes, in the Kunai. Yes, I saw that. I saw that. <laughs> The, the Ibukis are starting to go ahead of the, they're, they're going ahead of the game now. Galactic brain reads. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Nice use of that. Yeah, Ready. No command dash for you, but he get the double no, jab into Tatsu. Press up the board. Heavy. Everyone knows that. Come on, Tokino. So slippery right now. Yeah, doesn't risk a cross cut deeply there. You can see the angle of that jumping. Quite difficult for a Kumi to end here. Do it properly. Super jump. Nice flunky. Oh, this is big damage incoming. Gonna go for a knockdown. Plus. Takedo looking to bring this back. He's got all the meat ahead. One opening and it could be the end. Great use of the EX Kunai's in neutral here. Oh, oh my he's only god. got one Kunai left. It was oh all he needed. Oh my god. He bet the farm on that. One shank and a dream was all he needed. You know what? High risk, high reward, baby. That would have been negative infinity, but he, he just knew. That was gonna work. It would have been one hell of a galactic brain block had Takedo not done anything there and blocked that, that jump kunai release. Yeah, after the after the jump cross up that he blocked right. earlier, right. Fujimura is so good at setting this stuff up. Good jab there. Great start here for Fujimura. And his movement in neutral has been very difficult for Takedo to deal with. He's very slippery. Using that command jump to get in at certain angles, that V skill fully charged as well, catching Takedo off. Spacing it well as well, hard there whipping. Activates on block. No meter there, no mix up. Oh, what? Oh, no, he caught him crouching. I don't know what he's trying to do. Input a DP, perhaps. Oh, my That's God. Great oh, my to the God. He hits fireball. This guy's played insane. This is what we're talking about. Oh, he's not ready for what? the command dashes. He's getting opened up. Takedo completely frozen here. Oh, no, man, he the use of the Kunais in neutral, Logan. Stuffed. The EXs, the normals. So difficult to play right now, Takedo. It's impossible to react to all of it. This is what we're talking about. Could we be looking Absolutely at the CEO? impossible, and he's just setting up so much stuff. Are we looking at this year's CEO champion, level? I mean, he's, he's, the, he's the defending champion last year. He's playing a certain way. You mentioned this before the match started. When he gets into the top eight, he becomes something completely different. Both of these guys do. But Fujimura either wins or he finishes, like, seventh or ninth. Oh, my God, he's so active. So many so V-Skills trying to wake up with it there. Look at that anti here. Logan, he's played insane. Just does a V-Trigger after taking the oh, throw out of nowhere. Throw. Dash in and throw again. Takedo's really got to do something to oh, earn some respect here. double jab, only the single. No! no he's in block stun. No oh, punish. a rare drop and no punish. Jumped back, should have neutral jumped. Could have C8'd that and just... Yeah, anything would have done, right? Oh my, did you see the walk up into the crouch jab? But all day to punish that. And again, the walk up can chip him. Takino's got to be careful, he's got no meter. He's got no he can be reversal. Ah, oh, beautiful. Oh, yeah. still, it was still in block stun. He's in this round here, if he can get something. Oh my oh. god, he's just doing what he wants, Logan. He's doing whatever he wants right now. Takino's got to earn some respect. He's walking in his face, he's dashing in his face. Said before the set started that Fujimura definitely has the edge, but not like this. This is an absolutely dominant performance from Fujimura. He is, like you said, getting away with absolutely everything. I mean, it was like two rounds ago, he did like crouch medium into command. That's three times in a row and didn't get punished for it. He's walking backwards and forwards in front of him. Takedo seems a little, a little flustered here. Not even anti airing with DP now. Trying to anti air jab there. Not something you see often from Takedo. Yeah, he, he reliably just goes for DP. Gets a trade there, gets away with another escape from the corner. Oh man, such nice good amazing. timing of that V skill. And the anti air oh, with the light so Gary. Early. It gets rid of all the mix ups on the Kuma's jump as well. No dive kick, nothing. Anti gets a meaty off. Oh, the oh, he to the No fireball activation again. What side? What's oh, behind? Oh, is he, gonna get it? he is. Point. Of course he is. He always does. 
He knows exactly where he needs to close out the round, and it's set point Fujimura looking to give Tokido the wash. So dominant right now, Fujimura. Tokido confirms that crouch medium kick. Wow! Oh, the wind punish on the fierce. Everything. everything, everything's working. There we go. Gets a low forward finally. Oh, and this time the wake up oh, finally could be the end of it. Went for a fierce rider though. That actually let 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 people wake up. Just activates. Raw activation. Oh, oh he's he done. Gets it's again. done. That's it. Wow. And Torquedo eliminated from the tournament with a superlative performance from Whoa. Fujimori. He's looking in championship form on an incredible run from loser's bracket. As we said, losing only his second game in pools. He's run the gauntlet and he is here still in the final six. He will go on and uh, face, who's he gonna face? It'll be Daigo, oh my word. Man. This is gonna be one of the, hard if he wins this tournament, this is gonna be one of the hardest runs ever since Evo won Luffy, Dude, uh, I, since Luffy won Evo in like <laughs> 20. I <laughs> love it. Evo did win Luffy. <laughs> no, no, seriously, that Fujimura performance, that was quite scary. That reminds me of when Problem X was sitting in a in winner side of Evo, and Takedo was just bodying everyone in loser's bracket, and I was just in the crowd like, somebody please beat this guy.